Hello guys, welcome back to the third tutorial of this weekend, the Halloween warm-up. Today I'm back with a very similar design to yesterday, so we're Halloween in up Hello Kitty again, but this time it is going to be Frankenstein's monster. So we're just starting off the same as we did yesterday with a flat brush um, and this time green paint and we're just going to outline the shape of Hello Kitty. So straight across the nose, um, up into the ears. So they're pointed but still rounded at the top and I didn't quite get the vibrancy of the colour that I wanted with the brush so I went back in with a sponge and just filled in the rest of the face um, and made that green really really vibrant and thick and then I decided to do some shading so I loaded the other side of my brush with a dark green paint and then blended that in just around the corners around the cheek um, around the top of the head and then blending that down with the green that's already on the other side of the sponge Um, so yeah, I shaded around a bit of the ears as well and then just to make it a tad scarier we went into the eyes and kind of deepened them out a bit and then blended that out. Just all with the same sponge, really really quick. Next I've got some purple, pink and white on a split cake. Just because I think for Halloween purple and green go really well together. And then we're just going to create the bow. Um, so just pressing your brush, brush down and round and then round in a circle for the middle of the bow and then the same again on the other side. And then of course we're going to add some purple glitter on top of that just to make it really pop out. I didn't forget this time to add the little nose in so we're going to go with some yellow paint for this and a filbert brush and it just does all the work for you. Next we're going to add our sewn together look to our Frankenstein monster. So I'm using a really small number two brush and some black paint and I'm just going to create a rounded line across the face and then some stitches. So for the stitches you want to flick out from your line on both sides. And then just add in a quick outline to your bow and the ears and then around. Let me know in the comments down below which one you prefer, the mummy or the Frankenstein monster. I think the Frankenstein is my favourite, just because I got a bit more creative with this and you can add a few more details in, like these cracks here that I'm adding, just to give it a really worn, kind of beaten up look. Then I decided to add some bolts onto the side, so here I'm using um, a Grimace silver paint and a filbert brush again and then with the same filbert brush I just dip the tip into black just to add some shade in and it blends it for you because the silver's already on the brush and then we're just going to give it a quick outline so double your lines on the line nearest to you so that it looks a bit more 3D really light on your brush again and then of course we're going to add the Hello Kitty whiskers but with a twist this time I decided to make them um, like cobwebs so we're just going to web together those three whiskers and then we'll do the same again on the other side and then I decided to go in and add some more details like this patch as if it's another patch of skin um, sewn on to the Hello Kitty just with some stitches all around that and then a bit more of the beaten up look all around. We've done some like hashtag, uh, not the it was a hashtag, but a hashtag kind of look to add that really worn. And then I love this, I went back in and added some star blend to the eyes and just around the corners with some shading. It's so quick and it just adds really a lot of depth to your design and it, you barely need to blend it, you just put it on. That was an e.l.f. blush brush that I was using, it's just really quick and easy. So next I went in with some yellow highlights, just around anywhere that you want to highlight, anything that you want to pop out, just pop this yellow next to it and it will make it stand out a bit more. Added some highlights to the bolts and of course to our bow. And that is it, that's us done. 
um, yeah, like I said, let me know what your favourite tutorial from this weekend has been. I've done the pattern skull, the Frankenstein Hello Kitty and the mummy Hello Kitty. Um, I'm going to keep doing, rolling out these Halloween tutorials. So let me know if you've got any requests of anything you want to see. Um, subscribe if you're not subscribed already. I'm going to be working on lots of designs this week. And like this video if you liked it. And share if you're feeling really generous. And thanks very much for watching once again. Bye.